What if I told you the Philippines is defended by two silent guardians, two mountain ranges locked in an invisible battle against nature's wrath? On the east, the Sierra Madre, the first line of defense against Pacific typhoons. On the west, the Cordillera, fortress of the north, cradling the heart of Luzon. But which one truly stands stronger in the face of destruction? This is Sierra Madre vs. Cordillera, Typhoon Defense Showdown. The Philippines, an archipelago constantly tested by the elements. Each year, around 20 tropical cyclones enter the country's area of responsibility, making it one of the most typhoon-prone nations on Earth. But hidden within its geography are two natural guardians. The Sierra Madre, stretching over 500 kilometers from Cagayan down to Quezon, the longest mountain range in the country. And the Cordillera, towering with the highest peaks in Luzon, including Mount Pulag and the ancestral lands of the Igorot people. Both play critical roles in defending the nation, but in very different ways. When storms charge from the Pacific, Sierra Madre takes the first blow. Its dense forests act like a natural buffer, breaking down wind speeds, slowing down rain clouds, and reducing the impact of storm surges. Meteorologists call it the country's natural armor. During typhoon carding in 2022, Experts estimated that Sierra Madre's presence reduced potential wind speeds by nearly 30% before they reached Metro Manila. But the price of protection is erosion, deforestation, and loss. Each storm leaves scars, just like the Filipino people who rebuild time and again. Sierra Madre doesn't just protect, she endures, and that endurance defines the Filipino spirit. While Sierra Madre faces the storms, Cordillera braces the aftermath. It's the country's water tower, feeding the mighty Agno, Chico, and Cagayan rivers. These waterways sustain farms, hydroelectric dams, and millions of lives downstream. When heavy rains fall, the Cordillera absorbs and releases water, regulating floods and ensuring that Luzon's agricultural heartland survives. But it, too, is under siege by mining, deforestation, and human encroachment. Landslides and flash floods in Bengay and Ifugao are grim reminders that when the Cordillera weakens, so does the nation's foundation. Like Sierra Madre, the Cordillera's strength lies not in resistance alone, but in adaptation. Now let's put the Guardians head to head. Round 1. Location. Sierra Madre faces the Pacific, the frontliner of every typhoon. Cordillera sits inland, the second line of defense. Round 2. Structure. Sierra Madre is longer and wider, acting like a wall. Cordillera is taller and denser, like a fortress. Round 3. Roll. Sierra Madre blocks the wind and rain. Cordillera stabilizes the land and prevents floods. Together, they form the Philippines' ultimate defense system, nature's very own double barrier. It's not a competition. It's collaboration. One shields, the other sustains. But both guardians are under threat. In Sierra Madre, thousands of hectares of forest vanish every year due to illegal logging and development projects. In Cordillera, open pit mining and urban expansion carve deep wounds into its slopes, and as the forests disappear, so does our protection. Scientists warn, without these mountains, the next super typhoon could be catastrophic. Nature can protect us, but only if we protect nature first. From the Dumagat of Sierra Madre to the Igorot of Cordillera, these people have lived as stewards of the mountains for generations. Their wisdom 
teaches us balance, to take only what is needed and to give back through care. They remind us that the strength of the Filipino does not come from resistance alone, but from harmony. Sierra Madre and Cordillera are not rivals. They are partners in survival and symbols of our unbreakable spirit. In the end, it's not about which mountain is stronger, but whether we are strong enough to protect them both. Because when Sierra Madre falls, the coast suffers. When Cordillera weakens, the valleys flood. Together they defend us, and together we must defend them. I'm host Pinoy Halo Halo, and this has been Sierra Madre vs. Cordillera, Typhoon Defense Showdown. Subscribe, share, and let's raise our voices before silence takes the mountains away. I'll wear the storm across my chest. These lines were earned, I passed the test. Ink of fire, blade and bone, the warrior's path. I walk alone From island seas to mountain skies We carved our truths, we never lied Pintados rise